Heaven is for Real is a 2014 film with Greg Kinnear. It's a very interesting film that allows us to meditate upon how we respond to the mystery of God, his power, his method of working in the world, and his grace. The plot has a four-year-old boy who's in the hospital, and he's being given an operation which is very serious. His life is threatened, and during the course of this operation, he has a powerful vision of heaven. He's able to go to heaven, meet people there, and he's able to meet Jesus himself. And when he comes back, he relates this vision he has of heaven to his parents, to his father and his mother. And, some, and then through the parents, word gets out into the, the community that uh, this little boy, this four-year-old four little boy, has seen Jesus and spoken to Jesus in heaven and has talked to people who have passed away in heaven. The media, of course, takes interest in this and they come and they make the little boy a figure of fun and they seem to have, you know, their own agenda of, unfortunately, of just not taking religious very seriously. The most interesting aspect of the film is how people relate to the little boy, especially the father, Greg Kinnear. Kinnear doesn't believe his son, but he wants to believe. He wants to believe that his son has seen Jesus. The mother is really concerned for her son, and she just doesn't believe that, you know, that he's capable of, uh, of doing that. And many people in the community reflect uh, her point of view. What the film allows us to do is, allows us to meditate upon how in our lives, are there times when we've met people who have encountered Jesus through some type of conversion experience or through reading the Bible or some type of experience in church and that this really tap into Jesus and Jesus changes their lives. Do we feel threatened by this person? Do we feel uh, that we want to support this person? Do we feel jealous of this person? In this way, this little boy is very innocent and is very matter-of-fact about his experiences is able to become almost a mirror to people of how they respond to the power, to the grace of God in this world.